oh she's like you're she was like this package you need to shave she was like you don't uh you don't get it if you shaved your leg and i was like oh well i have i had like a little bit of hair to where they can actually like pull it <sighs> anyway that's another kind of pain anyway it doesn't matter okay so I, I did the wax they did some kind of lavender something on my leg they did a hot warm towel they put this bag of like liquid oh it was like hot liquid and they put it on my foot and i didn't think anything of it because my feet were in water it felt like water i don't i didn't i didn't think anything of it i don't like squishy i don't like slimy <laughs> welcome back to cassie j so today we are going to be doing a little bit of a different type of budget um, i'm only going to be focusing on one thing um i got this from sons and roses she actually had her freebie um she if you go to her instagram she'll have a link directly to this freebie i don't know how long it's going to be a freebie but i know it was on friday whenever i got this i immediately downloaded it okay i like the fact that it's like sunflowers and it's sons and roses that who actually gave uh, handed it out so this I'm actually going to be doing for, um, again, one challenge, um, and it's going to go towards my spa day. So today we're actually going to be speaking only about my spa day budget. If y'all are new here, thank y'all so much for joining me. I really do appreciate you stopping by. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if this is the type of content that you like. I do a lot of budget and cash stuffing videos um i am actually on a debt-free journey and i am in the process of trying to save for a house but because i'm not purchasing a house at the end of this year i'm not focusing 100 on saving every dollar towards that so i am in the process of just um, paying off my debt which is my student loans and then my vehicle payment and if y'all follow along y'all see that there's certain savings challenges that i actually do to make it to where i actually pay either double my car payment or more so go ahead and like and subscribe and leave a comment down below let me know that y'all are new here and for all my oldies but goodies um thank you so much for coming back i really do appreciate it but today we're going to be doing something a little bit different okay so i had this change in my purse y'all when i say it's been getting on my nerves i was like i'm not even doing a cash stuffing oh but today Y'all going in this, y'all going in this jar. I didn't even take the jar down. Like, I'm ready for, it to, I just wanted it out my purse. I'm sorry about that. I'm going to have to edit that out because whenever I move this, all this stuff, like, fell. And I'm just saying, I I had to pick it up. I was like, oh, my God, everything going to fall on me, Lord. All right, so let's go ahead and get these in here so we can start. Hopefully, my thing worked. It's not correct. Um, if it does work or not, if it doesn't work, I'm just going to throw everything in here, but I don't think it's correct. Oh, it says $72. I don't know if $72 is in here, but that's what it says. All right. So now that we got that out the way, it says $74.62. So I don't know if that's correct because I kept putting, I kept like opening the top and I just like threw change in there because I thought this wasn't working. And it's like this part right here will actually just, it will just um, work when it wants to. So if y'all get this, um, by all means, of course, use it. It's cute. It's awesome. It, what it, it counts. But I, for some reason, just got a, a bad battery or it's a glitch. I don't know. Anyway, so what I'm going to use this for. Um, so I decided that for my spa day, because I want to do like a huge spa day like i want to do a lot of stuff <laughs> and so um i actually looked up a couple stuff and this right here if y'all see it this is my like my overdraft of what i was actually thinking about doing and i'm going to make a de the decision with y'all of what i'm going to do over here so um for the actual spa day i want 625 dollars. so because there's 25 of these i went ahead and did $25 each one so whenever I come across $25 I'm going to color in one and then um, I also decided that I was going to have a certain envelope that's going to go towards this and I don't know if I'm going to make one or if I actually already have one so, so I just looked through my old envelopes to make sure that I didn't take it out but I don't have a spa um, a spa day and so I'm gonna make a cash envelope it's gonna fit inside of my large self-care so that it can just target that so my money won't get mixed up and I won't have too many envelopes even though it's even though it's an envelope instead of an envelope 
that it doesn't matter okay the, the point is I'm gonna make another one whenever I make other envelopes later on today so I'm gonna have uh, so I don't have it with me today but the next time I update y'all on my spa day um, then I will go ahead and make sure that I you know leave it with this so what I'm gonna do um, the coloring I'm probably gonna get just like a regular highlighter like this and just color it because I'm not really a like a pen or like a what are those map color type whatever or like it will be like a marker that's like big like this so for y'all for the ones that like to watch people color um, I will it's not going to be cute <laughs> I don't know how to color y'all. I don't want y'all's hopes to be high. We're going to have to lower them, okay? It's Cassandra y'all are talking to. Alright, so we're going to do a couple of decorations. I decided that since it is fall, throw some flowers on there. Um, nothing too crazy. Um, I want I want to focus more on... Um, I want to focus more on the actual saving itself than and the writing down of my choices of what I want. So, um, sorry y'all. Y'all know what time it is because I'm ashy. But just me doing the like the working like I all I do is work. I don't go out and do stuff. Whenever I do something, it's like a massage real quick, and it's just an hour, and then I'm right back to it. Or I'm taking the kids to a doctor's appointment or I'm trying to like focus on something that's going to either maintain benefit or you know cut like in like be included inside my home and especially since I'm working from home like I feel like I'm like overly stressed and so if I'm not working or you know maintain attending to the kids whatever I'm not doing anything like I try to watch tv and then I couldn't even watch a full episode because I was like let me do this and I ended up making phone calls and like the whole two episodes go by and I'm like what happened now I gotta watch some more <laughs> I suck y'all so this is, I'm just gonna put that I'm not gonna put too much on here so the first thing that I wanted to do whenever I was looking at stuff so I'm in San Antonio Texas I don't know if anybody is like aware of that or whatever the new people hey guys if y'all are in Texas hit me up but I'm in Texas okay and I like to I like to get massages I don't know I, I post it on Instagram story all the time I get a massage once a month or twice a month that's how that's how often I get a massage we go get our feet done and um, I don't like people I don't like people's fingers in my fingers okay when I said that out loud <laughs> it sounded weird it sounded more weird than what it's supposed to so I don't like like I don't like this and you know how like when you put fingers and stuff like that whatever I don't I don't like when other people's fingers are like in my fingers like it's just weird to me like I don't like holding hands if we hold hands I'm like I'm the person that holds hands like this or I'll like immediately let go and I'm like holding your arm like I don't like the finger in finger <laughs> I was actually talking to Mel Budgets and she she has made it official that I'm the most I'm one of the weirdest people she has ever known <laughs> And I'm just like, it's true. I mean, it might be true because I'm, I know I do weird stuff. Like, I don't like, I was telling her about a whole situation where I went to go get a pedicure. And, okay, so, okay. Let's, I get regular smegular pedicures, okay? Regular smegular, dip your feet, do the hand scrub, scrub with the cheese grater. You know, y'all know that's a cheese grater. I don't care what y'all say. That's a cheese, scrub with the cheese grater. And then I, you know, they they do the nails and they, they cut the cuticles and that's it that's not that's all okay so I had a few bucks and I didn't want to go home and I, my legs were sore and so I let them do my feet I got a, I got the biggest package that they had so they have this oil therapy um, mask um, something clay mask they had some kind of um, hot wax um, something it was a lot it was a lot so. I mean I got my legs waxed that's how that's how much it was like it was it was like 60 no like $65 like a 75 70 65 60 60 60 70 dollar package right I got my legs waxed um, you know how you're supposed to shave your shave your legs before you go 
that didn't happen. I was like, I'm glad. Then she was like, oh, she was like, you're, she was like, this package you need to shave. She was like, you don't, uh, you don't get it if you shaved your leg. And I was like, oh, well, I have, I had like a little bit of hair to where they can actually like pull it. <sighs> anyway, that's another kind of pain. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Okay. So I, I did the wax. They did some kind of lavender something on my leg. They did a hot, warm towel. They put this bag of like liquid oh it was like hot liquid and they put it on my foot and i didn't think anything of it because my feet were in water it felt like water i don't i didn't i didn't think anything of it i don't like squishy i don't like slimy oh 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 okay so they put my feet in this thing i'm thinking oh, okay it's no longer hot it's cold now but it's still water in my mind this is the first time and then um she comes over she like she goes, she was like, oh, she was like, are you okay? And I was like, yeah, I'm good. And so she takes the bag off and I heard like a, ooh, Jesus. I heard, <laughs> oh, I heard the, um, like the, the slime, the, oh, I can't even think about it and talk about it a lot. Um, it was like a noise. Ooh, that, it, oh, God. Then it was in between my toes. Oh, y'all. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Y'all don't understand the stuff that I had to go through. Okay. And then I have a whole nother foot. It's what has to happen twice. <laughs> I was not ready. I was not ready. I told the lady to wait. I said, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> wait. Okay. Hold on. Hold on, ma'am. You did not tell me this was going to happen. And she was like, what are you talking about? Like, I'm just supposed to know. Okay. No. No, ma'am. I don't know this stuff. I get regular smegular. I don't do this extra bully, bougie type stuff. Okay. Like, you put my foot in a bag of water. Okay. Water. You did not tell me there was going to be some slime. My feet. I didn't know my foot could make chemicals like that. Like, I, <laughs> yo. She was like. Are you ready? I said, no, I'm not. But it has to come off my foot because I can't walk with this on. Can you just imagine? Oh, my God. The slime and stuff. Is, oh, I was I was passed. I was almost passed out, y'all. I almost passed out. So I, like, had to turn on the, the, the chair machine all over again because it done turned off. I forgot I forgot the whole machine or whatever. So I had to turn the chair off so I could have, like, some kind of noise. The chair did not make no noise. I was like, okay. So I put, I had my phone on and I played, um... Uh, a YouTube video and I think it, the first one that popped up was like some kind of car something and it was really loud and so I put it up close to my ear and I was like okay go ahead and so she did it now my eyes is closed and I'm like focusing on the car sound and I didn't hear it I felt it so this time whenever she was trying to take it off I mean this one had you know the 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 slime was in between the toes but this one when she took it off it was in my feet y'all oh my Okay, so it wasn't in the foot. It was in the. It was in the toe. Oh God. It was in my toes. I I couldn't do it. I was like, oh, that's that's disgusting. What is that called again? And like, I'm literally like, ooh, ooh. <laughs> my shoulder done spiked up. Everything, y'all. I was. <sighs> okay. So yeah. Okay. 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 Ooh. I don't know why I'm weird. I had a whole moment. I can't do stuff like that. So I was like, you know what? Next time I'm going to ask questions. I don't care if I sound annoying or not. Like I want to know what it is you're doing. Make sure there's no slime, no nothing. I think it's like a wax that they call. Whatever it is, I'm just gonna like, don't put my foot in the bag. <laughs> don't put my foot in the bag. It was so gross. Y'all, never mind. Let's just go ahead and start this because thinking about it make me not want to put the pedicure on here. All right, so... Again, we do one spa. So the reason why I have 600 and, um, 625, was it 625 is because I want to pay for two. So in my mind right now, I'm probably going to go by myself because every time I tell somebody that I want to have a spa day, they always somehow either have something come up. They don't have the money. They can't afford stuff like that. Or, you know, it's always something if I'm in the mood to go and if I'm in the mood to pay for somebody else I want to be able to I'm not saying that the reason why I'm doing it is because I am going to for sure take somebody else with me because I mean I'd rather go twice two different times then have somebody go with me but if I'm in the mood to have somebody else go with me I would want to have that money that extra money and I want to go out and eat afterwards I feel like if you go have a whole spa day like ending it with something to eat and drink and then go home and to sleep <laughs> is a good idea okay so that's the reason why for the six six um 625 
So there's a couple of places and I'll go ahead and leave pictures and I'll have them um, over here um, to you know, let y'all see how I did some research and I actually looked around. I'm not going to show you the prices because the, a lot of prices actually changed and I don't want somebody to come across this in a couple months and be like, well, you said it was and I'm just like, yo, you pay what you see at that time. I'm sorry if you missed it, whatever. So there is one place that I had found and it was an it was a hotel and um, it's called the Makara Hotel and Spa and that is on the actual river walk. So I got a lot of the ideas there. So I was actually looking at the aromatherapy, the body exfoliation, and then the mud, the mud body polish wrap. Those were the three, the three things that I actually really wanted to do. Um, and those prices were actually pretty pricey. And you're not actually paying for the services, you're paying for the scenery. So I'm gonna go ahead and post some pictures of what I actually saw and how like nice it looks and how like the river and all that, whatever it is. And so um, I'll just let them run over wherever, right? So anyway, um, the other place that I actually looked at, which for, let me go to back, back to Macora. So I was actually looking at spa hotels. That was what I actually looked up here in San Antonio, Texas was spa hotels. And that's one of the things that popped up because, you know, of course it's like a tourist area. Um, a lot of people go downtown to do that. There was another one that was for La Cantera and La Cantera actually had, um, it wasn't as expensive but it was still expensive and they actually have really good packages so the one that I noticed the most that I really want was um, um, the the body exfoliation where they're basically scrubbing your body and they're they're doing um, they do different kind of salts and they do different kind of oils and stuff and there's like a waterfall of water that's falling on you the entire time that you are scrubbing them um, but by the entire time that you are being scrubbed <laughs> sorry sorry I just I was just thinking about school but so whenever you're like doing it I really 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 wanted it like I wanted that body scrub because I realized that like you whenever you go to get a massage or whenever you go get you know things whatever you get exfoliating things for like your face you get it for like your arms um sometimes you have like a body wash that you do like your front like your tits your back whatever stuff like that but you don't ever actually have like your full body exfoliated and I really want that especially me with me being on this weight loss journey I want my body to be in the process of like being renewed so you just like you know anything that's going to prevent my skin my skin from you know going back or bouncing back and i'm trying to prevent loose skin basically i just want to be, be able to do that and so this was one of the things that one of the ladies had suggested so i was like okay exfoliation i got you right so spa day i'm just gonna put a spa day budget oh hand don't do this not today okay i don't got time for no squeaking all right so because of the prices and because of how expensive it was, just that one um, exfoliating um, body uh, exfoliation on the river walk at the Macora was like, like $215. I am not paying $215 for something that I can get somewhere else for cheaper, okay? So I am on a budget and I know that this spa day package is going to be kind of expensive, whatever. So because I was going to school for this i actually have school prices and this is not just me this is actually anybody so if you go to the academy of massage here in san antonio texas and by the way i do have to say this is not a promoted type thing they don't know that i'm, I'm saying mentioning prices they don't know that i'm like you know trying to do this budget whatever this is just for me as of today here in san antonio texas is where i want to go and i'm not suggesting anybody to go there i'm just saying this is where I'm going. Anyway, so the um, Academy of Massage actually has a, um, I, I think it's called a Venti or Betty. Um, and they are actually really good with the Dead Sea Salt. It's, um, it's $35 whenever you go. Um, as of today, it's $35. And it's the, basically the same body exfoliation that I wanted. So that was one thing that I was going to put on here. And I'm going to put... Um, dead sea salt and it's called dead sea salt glow and that is 
35. So with that being said, um, they had packages. So when I was looking at the packages, I saw that there was every package that they have, of course, because it's a massage place, they have a wellness massage included either from 60 minutes to 90 minutes. And, um, every package, it tells you how long the package is going to be. So if you get like a uh, body exfoliation and the massage and something else it'll be like two hours and something or three hours or whatever so I wanted to make sure that I had this for sure but I also wanted to have the the mud the mud body mask treatment and And that was $68. So these are the two that I wanted for sure. Um, and that was $103 total, right? So, yeah, there's $103 total. I know how much it is. And then, um, so the first package that I saw that I was like really intrigued with was because they had a, a face treatment. And their face treatment, um, I really liked. But I already go somewhere for my facial. And so whenever I actually called them, I was like, what do y'all do during y'all's facials? Like, what do y'all require? What do y'all, you know? And so she said that they basically just do like a, um, um, like a hot towel. Um, they do like a massage on it. Um, and they don't do like any, like a derma, like a derma, microderm or anything like that. I was like, what am I saying? They don't do a microderm. They don't do stuff like, you know, like chemicals and stuff on your face. So I was like, okay, I could do a facial, I guess, you know, like I really don't know how that's going to go, but I mean, I could see it being relaxing. And so they have one that's called relax and escape. They have a foot treatment where basically they, they massage your feet and your legs. Then they have the face treatment. And then there's an hour and 30 minutes of a massage. And that's the whole package. And it's $136. There were other packages, but because I'm already getting the um, salt glow and the, the body wrap, then I was thinking a foot massage and a face treatment would be good, right? So these were the ones that I actually wanted to do. There were a whole bunch of packages. There were packages that were cheaper. Um, they had packages where just, you just get a massage and something else. And I think like the massage, like regularly right now is, um, $44. Oh, um, the one thing that I was going to put on here was the package, which is the relax and escape. So I'm gonna put a line under it because I'm going to, oh, let's put package because I'm going to forget it's, it's a package. I'm going to be like, what is that? All right. And so this is one. 36 and it includes the foot so relax and escape it's a package and it has the foot treatment facial and the 90 minute massage so my manicure and my pedicure so I want to try I want to try um, getting another another um, pedicure. I haven't gotten a pedicure um, at like the way I had got it that one time um, until since for, like two months. I think it's been two months. Ever since then I've been kind of just, the last time I got just regular smegular. Okay, $25. You do the regular stuff. You don't do no therapeutic nothing with nobody. Okay, don't be putting it. And then I want to get a manicure. A pedi and a manicure. And I want to do a big package. And so I found a place that um, their, their largest pedicure is um, $50 and um, they do basically everything that the other package that I have paid $70 for, they do that the same thing. So it is $50 um, and I'm, I'm going to put $55 because I like to leave them a tip because dealing with me, y'all, y'all. And then I'm going to do... Why does this pen act like that? It's such a great pen. And then you just... Um, 
and then there was a manicure that I want to say was 60 I think for like a regular manicure it was like $30 but if you do like a set but I like to get shellac so it could last longer and I like to get nude colors I don't like attention to it and I, or if if it's not like the full nail it will be um white tips french tips so I think I want to put a good 60 just because I want to make sure that, you know, I get somebody else. But, I, I mean, I think that it's not as expensive. I think it's like $30 for a shellac anyway. Maybe $40. I don't, I don't know. I haven't got my nose done in so long. Hopefully that's enough. All right. So, if it's not, then I, I'm, I have no problem with saying no. But, mm, no. Or I'll just have them do my nose and I won't get any painting on it. And that, that they won't do shellac or anything like that. So, I'm okay with my nose. Alright, so the next thing that uh, I wanted to do, of course, I, we're going to get my eyebrows done. The lady that I go to, um, she is only $12. Um, she, I think she's like 10 but I, I, just, give her 10, I just give her 12 Um, And that is one place. She's like really good and I get threading. I don't get wax, I get thread. Um, she wants to do my eyelashes. I told her that if I go back, that she'll do my eyelashes. And it is um, $35 for my eyelashes. And then because I have to have something done to me before I have it done to my, my kids. So, <laughs> yeah, I do the guinea pig thing. Like, if it, does, if it messes me up, I'm not going to have my kids do it. So, then, okay. I'm going to let y'all know now, this is going to be my first time, and I don't know if I'm going to go through with this, y'all. I don't know if I'm going to go through with this, but I wanted to do the Brazilian wax. So, a lot of people talk to me about it. A lot of people have told, I've, I've talked to people that have done it before. They say that once you get the wax, you will never want anything else. Some people are like, you should just do Nair. Don't do it. You're, it hurts. And then some other people are like, you know... The only thing that bothers me the most is whenever the the hair comes back, but the hair comes back and it's like, you know, a month or two, you should just go ahead and do it again. So I've been watching a whole lot of YouTubers. I've been watching people that vlog. I've been, you know, trying to find out like the, like if it's a great idea. I mean, everybody's different. I understand that everybody has their own opinion, but I'm trying to find somebody that's going to convince me to do it. So I found someone and she actually just got, um, she just moved to like South Carolina or something like that and she was trying to find a new place and so she found someone and they she said that these people were a lot better than the last time that she had got and so I was like it just has to be the people like if they're experienced or not so I was like okay I'll find somebody that's experienced and um, so I just did some I just did some uh, research or whatever and I did find a place um, and I can't remember how much it was um, for that. Let me look it up right now. Thank you so much for for waiting or pausing or coming back or staying with me. I appreciate it. So I'm gonna go ahead and just show y'all the list. So the the what I was actually looking at is eyebrow shaping. I thought that was actually pretty cool. It's twenty dollars for eyebrow shaping, um, tweezings, which I thought would be the worst thing ever, but it's twenty two dollars. And then upper lip, ten dollars. Chin, ten dollars. Um, sideburns or neck is $20 ears $20 like that threw me off nostrils 15 your full face to get wax is 45 full face and eyebrows 55 bikini line 35 French bikini is 55 and then Brazilian wax for female and male is 65 hopefully the person that I go to is actually in the is going to do that with me because we it, so far we are now at the third place <laughs> um, to do this um, fourth place because this is a whole different place so it will be this place and then one this place and then two so the fourth place but so far this is what I have um, I'm gonna have to think of the names of these two places I know where they're at but I don't actually know um, the names of them I just kind of just go in there and then um, so so far this is what I have and just so that we can actually have a sum total of how much it actually is just to make sure that 625 is good enough 
um, because I want to go to, um, I would love to go to a Brazilian steakhouse. Y'all, that is a, a whole, um, that is a, a whole type of only on income tax, only when you have a lot of money coming in when, <laughs> type of place because it's like $60 for you to eat and that's not including your drinks, okay? So, and it's just for one person, $60 for one person. So if y'all haven't gone, y'all should actually check that out in your area and see if it's something that you're willing to go to. But let me go ahead and calculate. So we have 35, 68, So just for myself, $466 would be the amount that uh, would cover for all of that. Let me go ahead and do that again just to see because that's crazy. 35, 68, 136, 55, 60, 12, 35, 65. Yeah, so 466 would be the total and that's not even including if we go out to eat so that is a lot and i plan on doing this all on one day so my original plan is um i'm going to actually take y'all with me um we're going to do like a vlog type spa day um type thing so I really want to um, do like a vlog for you and just to show you um, my spa day package because usually I do stuff like this and um, I don't do everything. I, do, I get like a massage. I'll go get a facial, uh, get my eyebrows done, get a pedicure, uh, but I don't actually get like the eyelashes. Um, I don't get like all this, whatever. And so this is all at one time. And of course, I'm not going to do this like once a month, but um, I do want to try to get this done at least by the end of July or before I have um, my surgery. So hopefully we can come across $466 so that um, I can get this done. If I do take somebody with me, um, they're going to have to come up with the other amount and I can possibly like give them like a gift card or something or you know just have the money on me so they can actually pay um so 625 minus 466 i would have roughly 160 dollars for them um if anything they'll be able to do like this part not even this part because what this is 103 and this is 136 <sighs> yeah see I might be able to do this just to the manny and petty with them if, if they can't do something with me because that's all i'm going to pay for is that amount if i even pay for that again i really i'm 100 100 okay with going by myself because usually that's how things happen anyway if you could afford it go but most times you go by yourself <laughs> but anyway so thank you so much for joining me i really do appreciate it if, i hope y'all enjoyed um this type of vibe um, I am going to be trying to do more um, budget videos with you because I have a lot of um, ideas and goals and stuff that I would really like to do with the kids by myself or on a date and um, I, I know that sometimes just watching people's stuff envelopes are kind of boring so I kind of want to add more to it so show you all the behind the scenes and why I'm actually saving money for a certain package and this would be one of the reasons why I would want to save and so what if I show y'all an update, I will probably show y'all like what, how much money I put in here, do that um, savings tracker with you, and then we can just put up like a star or something next to whatever we have um, covered. So more than likely, eyebrows will be the first one. <laughs> but thank y'all so much for joining me. If y'all have done any of these, please leave it in the comments down below. Let me know what y'all have done. And if you liked it or if you've done it before, if there are, if there are other things that you've actually tried please let me know i'm willing to try anything i want to try anything 
um, if y'all can, if y'all are here in San Antonio or even if y'all are here within Texas and y'all want to join me and y'all do a come day a trip, I'm okay with either going to your city or you coming to mine and we have a spa day together. So thank y'all so much for joining me. Y'all stay blessed, stay beautiful, and stay safe. Bye guys.